It was a gathering of players in the reproductive health sector as the MTN Foundation unveils another people-centric intervention. The Yellow Heart Initiative aimed at tackling the high rate of infant and maternal mortality in Nigeria. The Executive Secretary of the Foundation sheds light on why the Foundation chose an initiative that centers on infant and maternal mortality. We're concerned about the health indices of mothers and children and we wanted to find a platform where we all collaborate with the Federal Ministry of Health, bringing all together different um, stakeholders playing in this field to see how we can jointly work to reduce the um, really devastating um, statistics that we ha have. The chairman of the foundation who paints a gloomy picture of Nigeria's infant and maternal mortality rate insists that partnership between the government and the private sector is a feature of development of any kind in the country. Government cannot do everything for everybody. But just talking about it and saying the government can't, we must do something, is just talk. It's about time somebody did something and that's why we say uh, the PPP will be translated into this project of um, the Yellow Heart Initiative and the government itself has shown enthusiasm because it's a very very typical example and illustration of how the PPP can be not on the talking stage but also in the implementation stage. The Ministry of Health praised the initiative by the MTN Foundation as a step in the right direction to reduce infant and maternal mortality. This is a very commendable initiative and we expect that other uh, private uh, companies should equally uh, come up with initiatives like this as part of their own uh, corporate social responsibility. Nigeria has the second highest number of infant and maternal mortality rate in the world. That with this kind of initiative, the numbers may begin to decline. Amaka Okafo, Channels Television News.